Hi, Friday. Somehow, it keeps happening. Didn't think it would. Not... I was about to say two days ago, but that's not true because that is not Monday. Two days ago is... Well, I'm doing this Thursday, so that was Tuesday. Uh, I'm having problems. Brain is falling apart still. Whoever said that eventually through this week my brain would work better, clearly wrong. It's just continuous degeneration of my brain and its ability to talk. Put forth for you and your... Really, that is hilarious. Put forth for you three times a week to document it, to know how bad I'm doing. So I see that there's Brazil. I also see... Mm, it's not Brazil, uh, India. It's something else. Like, this almost is Brazil. And I don't know, e this equal distribution, I still don't know what that means entirely. And I don't know if that's like a phone minute, phone card thing that sells phone cards to different countries. You want some penison? It's like venison from deer dick. Deer dick meat? Yeah, penison. <laughs> Oh, what's happened? That's like a Lithuanian flag, but it's not. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. Like, I'll just say Brazil, but I know it's not. I have, like, zero faith in my ability to uh, pinpoint anything anymore. After, it was just the eight points I got last time. It just ruined it. Can't do anything about it. Except, I mean, try. This definitely doesn't feel like Brazil. It's too arid. Nothing. Boli it's Cal Bolivar. It's like street road. The fuck is this? It was a little anchor in that voice. I didn't mean it for me. What is this UNESCO? Unidad Democrata. There's something happening here. I like this flag here. If I knew the rest of the song, the words to stop, listen, what's that sound? Everybody, look what's going down. It's just, again, Christ the Redeemer. Everything here is just screaming. Brazil, it just doesn't feel like it to me. I got a minute left, and I don't know what flags those are. Is there anywhere in Brazil that's this arid? This feels like maybe like a Peru type thing. That is not Peruvian in any way. All right, I can keep spending all my time doing a circle here or I can uh, get a little, all right, yeah, this feels more like a Peru or Bolivia. It was Bolivar, isn't that like uh, what Bolivia is in their language? I was about to say Bolivian, but no. I don't care. That is not true. If I didn't care, I would be trying. Oh, shut up. I'm going to get the beeps again from my, uh, from, from starting up my computer recently. And it's just going to happen. I'll live with it. I think I got the right country. I'm feeling somewhat confident. But who knows? We'll know in five. No, we're going to know right now. Okay. I was close. I'll take it. Uh, anyway. What's been new this week? This is beautiful. This is... Ooh, I don't know where this is. Not yet, at least. Um, <clears throat> the book I started, I don't think I've talked about that yet, for this month. Uh, Neil Gaiman's North Myso Norse Mythology. Now, I did start this book, uh, a different book, around the same time I started Guard of War. That was uh, Norse Mythology. By some other guy, which was pretty good. I just kind of just stopped um, reading it. Doesn't mean it was bad. It's just this thing I do also happens with certain games, like Red Dead being one of them, where I'll just play it for a while, like a week or two, and then just never, n ever pick it up. And uh, this book kind of fell into that. 
I mean, Red Dead was just kind of boring to me, but that's just me. This feels very much like in Italy, like up here. And we'll we'll go from there. Um, okay, Trento. What do we got? What do we have? Hmm. None of these help me. This is very pretty, though. But this book's great. I don't know what I was really expecting coming into it. Like, I've never read any of his stuff before. He seems to be very much... Um... Well regarded, kind of just like everyone else I've read so far this year. Uh, it's just basically myth mythological tales from Norse mythology. It's pretty interesting, though. I don't know why I have this level of re level of regard for. Um, oh, there's Trento. Wait, did I just did I see that? Let me see. I don't know why I have such high regard for Norse mythology compared to like other. Eighty-one to Trento. All right, I'm I'm gonna focus in a bit on this compared to other religions, but I just like the storytelling. I mean, there is some I mean to say, oh, there's some thought put into it. No, it's just dumb. But I don't know how else to explain it. It's very interesting to me how like multifaceted most of them are like um one of the stories i read had to do with uh how thor got his hammer and you know everyone hates loki you know he's always been like reviled one no one ever th like in the other book i was talking uh read talked about how you know some people think of like loki as an anti-hero or there's the concept of the anti-hero when it comes to um dealing with different gods in in their societies, but no one ever liked Loki. He was always just the reviled one. He did everything that was awful. But in some stories, they see, he, he was still, like, very, um, not important, yes. Like, things he did was, um, was beneficial. Like, he was, yes, everyone hated him. Everyone was, he thought he was a piece of shit, but... They still went to him for advice. They still talked to him, confided in him, uh, asked him for help. Uh, he did things for them. And you can't just always... Okay, this is near water. Are we, like, here? Maybe we're here. This is really fucking nice. And maybe it's just my oversimplistic view of a lot of other... Well, it's not a religion either, but culture. Where, no, these multifaceted, even Zeus, like, they... This is some duality here. That is one fucking modern building in this this place. Uh, let me see what this truck says. I feel this is South America somewhere. I don't know where... Is that just... Yeah, that's just Jesus on your van. Um... Or is this... No, this is not Vietnam. This is South America, I'm going to say. But, like, even Odin, he's, like, the head god guy, but even he did shady, sketchy shit, and he's, like, super hailed, and also a lot of the bad... He was also kind of a piece of shit, but it's not so much people look past that. They're just like, yeah, that's just who he was. And it's just, the stories they have are pretty interesting. I mean, I'm sure I could do that with any other, like, quote-unquote, really, what are you? Oh, it's a hand behind that. I thought that was your hair. That's a pose you got, buddy. Any flags? Nope. All right. Can I get a flag for where we are? Or at least a language? Maybe? Anyway, good book. I'm enjoying it so far. Fast read, too. I'm, like, halfway through it in a week. I've been reading basically, like, maybe a chapter, chapter two a night. Okay, we got .com, so it doesn't help me. Now, these places look like towns. Okay. Uh, I'm going to do a little bit of hiking this weekend, uh, but the monthly hike is going to be next weekend. 
That's the hope. Uh, pardon me, I have to crack my knuckles because I can't help it. Hopefully that doesn't gross you out too much. But, yeah, I'm going to have a good weekend. Um, had another, like, snap of, slap of reality of how actual old I am. And I found out one of my nephews is having a birthday and his age is surprising to me. Because I'm not expecting him to be as old as he is. I don't know where this is. Like, I'll say Ecuador, but I... Zero idea. I need something to help me. Utervo. Yeah, that doesn't help me. I got a minute left. I've not seen anything to help me figure out where we are yet. You got your souped up little tuk-tuk thing. Yeah, we got... Kutervo. I don't know what that is. No sombreros allowed here. That's mean. Is that a cow in the back of your truck? It is. Yeah, they hate hats here. What do the hats do to you? What do we got? Oh, Peru. Okay. We're in Peru. A little tiny Peruvian town up in the mountains. I'm going to say we're in this one for no reason. Oh, wait. Wait a minute. <laughs> It just said, I, I might have an idea where we are. Yeah, Cutervo. Can I find a Cutervo anywhere? <clears throat> this is a big enough country. I don't think I'm going to be able to find it. It's going to be a very low-key weekend. Gonna be, we're combining his birthday kind of with some other people's in the family. It'll be a good time. But you're just like, you're this old? I end up doing the whole old part. Oh, I remember when you were just a little guy. And it just puts everything into perspective. It's like, no, that actually was. that. His, he, he was born way, like, the time he was born to what it is now, you're just like, whoa. I don't understand. Oh, there was a Kutervo. Okay. Oh, and it was completely visible from there. That's fine. That's okay. Okay, upper deck hits the spot. This looks... Hmm. There is English here, and there is also... Spanish? And some very old colonial looking things here. These are very European. Uh, veranda, none of the, this. Monaco? Maybe? This this looks like it could be a thing. This doesn't look like the racetrack that um let's see. Water's edge flay. This is completely touristy, but I'm not finding anything to help me figure out where we are yet. Nope. This place looks hot, like temperature-wise, kind of uncomfortable. All right, what do we got? This is Southern Fried Chicken. Simply lip-licking to flavor. That's it. It, I don't like lip-licking. Yeah, it's just a. It, it, it's, it sounds gross to me. Glen Eagles, huh? Oh, we do have a flag. Um, shit. That looks like a old-timey province flag. Yeah, that doesn't help me. We get a ferry somewhere. Hmm. Ferry, Southview Bar Restaurant. This is 100% like the island. The Torah Agricultura. Hmm. Yeah, nothing's helping me here. Hylix, wait, okay. Steering wheels are on what side? Some, this may help me. Let me get back up here and just take a look at these cars. Okay, we got British... <clears throat> excuse me, British Colony. Let's get on the ferry. Trips to Camino and Blue Lagoon. What is this? I am completely thrown here. Malta. All right. That's the Maltese, Mal, is it Maltese, Malta flag? 
I mean, I'm going to say, unless Gozo, oh yeah, so we've got either one of those two. Um, all right, I've somehow got myself, okay, a little disoriented. We are on a ferry. Where's this, well, it's a ferry connecting either one of these two places. Um, let's take a look to see if I can't find Paradise Bay Bistro. Let me hit home. All right. So we're next to what? What are we next to? I got to figure this out. Paradise Bay Bistro. Are we next to Marfa? Or are we over here? Let me just take a look. Could it be this? Yes, it is. We're like right here. On this turn, this is going to be an amazing score. If I'm going to toot my own horn. Okay, Glen Eagles was a little farther. So we're like here, aren't we? Is there an upper deck thing around here? Yep, I fucking nailed it. Yeah. Oh, there's one more. Even better. I thought that was it. This is claustrophobic. Is this a car? Um, what do we got? Feeling Portugal or Spain? Man, we're going too far. I can't see what that said. Stop staring. They want to rob you. You're, you're, you're creeping me out, buddy. Get me out of get me out of this little 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 cubby hole here. I was about to say, don't say I'm. This is it. Okay. Okay. We've got Pola Nepencia. Okay. Hmm. Alameda. This is tropical. Oh, you're not helping me at all. Is this... What is this? We got donor kebabs, pizza and hamburger, house. Zona video vixiata. That doesn't help me. This is this is bad. I can't make that out. Is this turkey? This doesn't feel like turkey. This is where it's all gonna. I'm not gonna get over two thousand thanks to this one. I think there's not enough here. I am full panic now, folks. Nothing here is. I need to Generali Segros Juan Cross God, what is this? What is this? I am baffled. Austria? I mean it's Europe somewhere. I'm just going to say, like, this is this is definitely not it. I don't know what to do. I have English. None of this look... This is touristy as fuck. It's... It can't be. Palm trees. None of this... Like, this kind of looks Greek, but it asks... Uh, Apostolo 2017. Zona. The fuck is this? Video Vixia. I don't know what. Looking at the people. Pulpo. I'm going to say. I'm switching it and saying 
here. I have no idea. I am like it's not one of the two places that that are it's not Germany, it's not India. A A A Apostolo? What the fuck's Apostolo? I don't I don't know. This one we'll find out. Is it Italy? Is it Turkey? Is it Portugal? I know it's Spain. Is it actually a place called Apostolo? Santiago to whatever. No, whatever. A lot closer than I thought. Pretty strong score this time, except for that last one. Just threw me for a goddamn loop, but... Even with that eight point we had, we had at least one 5,000. Do we have two? I don't know. I wish I could say I was happy with the entire week, but the majority of it was pretty good. But that's going to do it for another week. We keep making it through this. You do too. Congratulations. You're doing a really good job. Existing. Continuing to do so. Just know that when you come back here on Monday, you're going to hate it just because it is Monday. But I'm going to hate it too, and we're going to hate it together. So until then, try to have a good weekend. We'll see you here bright and early one week from, no, not one week, however many days it is. I can't do math right now. I'm very tired. I'll see you later. Goodbye.